everybody, welcome to Trilogy Tech Talk, brought to you by Violin Memory. Up next is Sony, and I'm here with Gary Mandel, the product manager. Gary, how you doing? I'm doing very well. How about you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm excited. It's still early, so we've got a lot to do, a lot to cover, a little bit of time. So, Gary, I hear you guys are showing 4K monitors. So, what's, what's, what's going on with that? Actually, we're showing a little more than 4K. Yes. Um, this year, we're showing our BBMX 300, which is a 30-inch 4K OLED. Now the big thing about this, is, well, there are a couple of things about this. One, it's a true 4K panel, mm -hmm. so there's no image uh, scaling, there's no scanning in the monitor. So every format that we display is always pixel to pixel mapped. So there's no errors, there's no nothing different. It's no This is showing you what you got. The other thing we are doing with it is it does high dynamic range. And high dynamic range is a new way of displaying images. Uh, typically, what we've done before is images were always displayed at about 100 nits. Um, and that's how production has been forever and ever. Um, in high dynamic range, what we're doing is we're using 1,000 nits, so 10 times the brightness out of the monitor. And we'll scale the video at a different rate, basically called an EOTF, or Electrical Optical Transfer Function. And what that does is we can push more image information into the picture. So it's a much more vivid picture. You're seeing a lot, of, lot more of what is in the image and a lot of things you've never seen before. And it's startling when you look at it. We have a demonstration uh, in the booth that we can't get people out of the way. Uh, the third thing that this does is this uh, will display a color, a range of colors, a color gamut um, called ITU RBT 2020, which is a new UHD TV standard that's come out. Um, and that's a very hard color gamut to display, but this monitor can do it. So we're very happy with this. Um, this is making images we've, no one's ever seen before, and uh, it's causing quite a, a, a stir in the show. And Gary, how is this impacting the media and entertainment industry? Well, the response has been overwhelming. Uh, most of the studios, uh, most of the production houses in the country, uh, especially Hollywood and New York, have responded. Um, they want to see it, they want to use it, uh, and we see a lot of these going out and becoming a standard out in the post-production industry. Um, the other thing that we've gotten from them is uh, we're the only monitor uh, manufacturer to receive an Emmy and an Academy Award for our monitor technology. And that's how they're responding to this. It's a big deal. It's a huge deal. <laughs> so we're, we're very pleased with the results of everything that's happened so far. Great. And is there anything else you'd like to add? I mean, what's, what else is going on with Sony? I know that's one part of Sony that you guys are covering at NAB. Is there anything else you'd like to touch base on? Well, I'm only the monitor guy, so that's the one I'm really only clued in on. Um, we've got quite a few things going on. Um, we're showing a truck, first 4K production truck, I think, that's out there. Um, that's on the booth. Uh, we're showing things, uh, new archival using uh, ODA. Uh, we have a uh, new switcher system that we're showing. IP yeah. Ready Live yeah. production switcher. Switcher, so yeah. all IP-based uh, mm -hmm. distribution. Um, we're showing uh, some new workflows in 4K uh, and in our AVC, uh, AVX, AVXC uh, uh, compression uh, system. Uh, so there's quite a bit. So how do you guys handle all that data? Well, you need to talk to those guys about that, <laughs> but um, actually, almost in every way, um, we're showing uh, uh, plugins for Adobe and uh, Apple and uh, uh, DaVinci and Filmlight and everywhere to show that you know XAVC is very easy to move through and to work in. All right, Gary, and what are you going to get into while you're in Vegas? I mean, I'm, this exhibit is huge. Is there anything that you want to see? Yeah, I would like to see a couple of things. I'd like to see what's going on with other display manufacturers, see what they're doing. I'd also like to go and um, uh, see more of what's happening on set. What are people doing and uh, uh, how are they doing it? So I'm really looking forward to that. All right, Gary, well, thank you very much for your time, and I'll see you around, hopefully. We'll see you around. All right, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Take care.